Hello students. Welcome to Teach You Smart. Let's continue our journey through rational numbers. In previous sessions, we discussed commutative property for whole numbers and integers. Whole numbers and integers are commutative for addition and multiplication, but not commutative for subtraction and division. Today, we are going to check commutative property for rational numbers. Take two rational numbers, 1 by 2 and minus 1 by 3. We will start with addition, 1 by 2 plus minus 1 by 3. Here, the denominators are not same. By taking the LCM of 2 and 3, we get 6. So, 1 by 2 plus minus 1 by 3 equals 3 by 6 plus minus 2 by 6 equals 3 plus minus 2 whole divided by 6 is equal to 1 by 6. Also, minus 1 by 3 plus 1 by 2 equals minus 2 by 6 plus 3 by 6 equals minus 2 plus 3 whole divided by 6 is equal to 1 by 6. That is, 1 by 2 plus minus 1 by 3 equals minus 1 by 3 plus 1 by 2 equals 1 by 6. Here, changing the order of numbers does not affect the result. So, for any two rational numbers a and b, a plus b equals b plus a. Therefore, addition is commutative for rational numbers. Now, let's look at subtraction of rational numbers. Subtracting minus 1 by 3 from 1 by 2. We know LCM of 2 and 3 is 6. That is 1 by 2 minus minus 1 by 3 equals 1 by 2 plus 1 by 3, which is equal to 3 by 6 plus 2 by 6 equals 3 plus 2 whole divided by 6 is equal to 5 by 6. Now subtract 1 by 2 from minus 1 by 3. That is minus 1 by 3 minus 1 by 2 equals minus 2 by 6 minus 3 by 6 equals minus 2 minus 3 whole divided by 6 which is equal to minus 5 by 6 that is 1 by 2 minus minus 1 by 3 is not equal to minus 1 by 3 minus 1 by 2 therefore subtraction is not commutative for rational numbers Next, look at multiplication of numbers. On multiplying 1 by 2 and minus 1 by 3, we get minus 1 by 6 and minus 1 by 3 multiplied by 1 by 2 is equal to minus 1 by 6. That is 1 by 2 multiplied by minus 1 by 3 equals minus 1 by 3 multiplied by 1 by 2 equal to minus 1 by 6. Here, changing the order of numbers does not affect the result. So, for any two rational numbers a and b, a multiplied by b equals b multiplied by a. Therefore, multiplication is commutative for rational numbers. Lastly, let's look at division of rational numbers. On dividing 1 by 2 by minus 1 by 3, that is 1 by 2 divided by minus 1 by 3 equals 1 by 2 multiplied by the reciprocal of minus 1 by 3. That is 1 by 2 multiplied by minus 3 by 1 equals minus 3 by 2 and minus 1 by 3 
divided by 1 by 2 equals minus 1 by 3 multiplied by the reciprocal of 1 by 2 that is minus 1 by 3 multiplied by 2 by 1 which is equal to minus 2 by 3 that is 1 by 2 divided by minus 1 by 3 is not equal to minus 1 by 3 divided by 1 by 2. Therefore, division is not commutative for rational numbers. Let's recall what we discussed today. For any two rational numbers, A and B, A plus B equals B plus A and a multiplied by b equals b multiplied by a. While a minus b is not equal to b minus a and a divided by b is not equal to b divided by a. Hence, we can say that for rational numbers, addition and multiplication are commutative while subtraction and division are not commutative. Before winding up, let's summarize. The commutative property for whole numbers, integers, and rational numbers. The commutative property applies to whole numbers, integers, and rational numbers, and it holds for both addition and multiplication operations. Now, let's check how much you understood by doing an activity. If A equals 1 by 3, and B equals minus 4 by 5, check whether it is commutative for addition and multiplication. That's all for now. See you all in the next class.